Hi, I'm going to show you how to register children for assessment with OxEd's apps, language screen, reading screen and math screen. For the purposes of this demonstration, I'm going to assume you already have an OxEd account and that your school profile has been set up. Here we are, I've logged in and the first thing I'm going to do is select my school. I know some of you work across several schools, but I just have one. In the bar at the top of the screen, you can see that I'm an admin for the school's OxEd account, which means I have permission to manage pupil records. If you're not an admin, but think you should be, contact the owner of your school's OxEd account. Click on your role to see who that is, and you can find out more information about what the roles mean too. Now I'm going to click Create Class. I'll give the class a name and select a year group. And I'm going to Create Class. Then I'm going to click Add Pupil. I'll show you how to add just one pupil first so you can see how easy it is. But in a moment I'll show you how to upload a whole class at a time. I'll enter the details for my pupil. First name and surname. The date of birth is important as our assessment results take the child's age into account. For the pupil reference, if this is a state school in England or Wales, you need to enter their unique pupil number or UPN. Otherwise, you can enter any unique reference you use to identify the pupil. Select their gender and there's some optional socioeconomic information, which in the future will feed into assessment reports. But we'll leave that for now. I'll click Create Pupil. Now the page is reloaded, we can see that a unique QR code has been generated for Sarah. And that's what I'll need to assess her with one of our apps. Now I'll show you how to import the data for a whole class. If we return to the class and click Import Pupils, you'll see there's a button, Download Import Template. Let's have a look at the template. You can populate this with pupil data from your school's management information system. Here's one I made earlier. I'm going to select that file and start importing pupils. It'll think about that for a few seconds and then we're given the opportunity to review the results. This one has a problem, so I'll amend the spreadsheet and try again. Everything is OK this time, so I'm going to click Confirm Import. And now we've registered a class of pupils ready to be assessed with one of OxEd's apps, language screen, reading screen or math screen.